hunters and gatherers. Yeah, so hunter gatherer. Uh, what were we talking about before that? Like, cause, cause that was an what extension off of a bigger idea. Uh, um, the fact that we've always been like kind of pack animals. Um, I don't know, we were talking about being primal as opposed to being modern. Like, and like, that being, like, a corruption of thought. Cave, like, cavemen are the most primal thing I can actually think of. Like, like, cause there's very, like, we don't have a lot of examples of, like, true primal. What is true primal? Like, like that would be before the cavemen, honestly. What, what is that? Like, look okay, like? let me like, find what are the tendencies of a true primal. Uh, uh, for, what for what I'm talking about, it would have to be the two before, but nothing. Before that. No, but what, are the, what is the behavior the, of a true primal? What makes them primal? What makes them primal? Makes them primal? Yes. The, way, like, the way, like, in which interact they with interact with others. But what does that look like? Um. Then we gotta define, then we gotta define like, primal the primal instincts. Yeah, I'm about, like, like, I'm talking about, like, going for. almost purely those. instinctual. So what does that look like? Uh, let's see. Uh, okay. So, okay. So, so for, me, the for me, the most primal thing would to be like just do things, just do things based off of instincts. Of instincts. And if we're gonna think about what instincts are, I've got to think of a few. Satisfying um, the sexual obviously, urge. that's one of them. That's an instinct, but that's not like a huge one. I was thinking more like I think it's pretty big if you count it as the main goal, right? It is, but I'm talking about like super, super like instinct. Because okay, if you want me to be honest, it's survival first, and then it's you know. Uh, uh, it's having a child. So survival and then so the the stress hormones. Because if you're not if you're not surviving, first of all, then it doesn't matter. It's like okay if you're if you're being attacked by like a gorilla or something like back then, and you still haven't had a kid, it's like well. I'm getting out, but then it's like if you did have your kid and you're like your kid was there, and it would depend on the situation. More than likely, you would die for your child to survive. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Right. But and that's not always the thing nowadays. People think they think about it. Back then, I would think you would do that without hesitation. Is selflessness a primal instinct? No, actually, it's usually very selfish, and even protecting your child is somewhat selfish, because it's, I would assume it's making you feel good, knowing that you protected your child before you died. In is anything selfless? Oh, are you, are we going into this? Is anything selfless? No, nothing selfless. I can agree with that, I agree, nothing is selfless. We've reached an even ground. 
Are we going to Sterner? Is that what his name is? Max I Sterner? I don't know what you're talking about. Spooks? Spooks meme? Yeah, there we go. Yeah, there we go. Max Sterner, that's what his name is. That guy was nut, but he was technically right. There you go. Fuck! I need Boy. another large Titanite shore. Okay, so, okay, so like that, if you like that stuff, you'll probably like Max Sterner. I don't have Discord open for now. Hold on. Re. Re. No, why just read a, like you don't even need to read a bunch of this stuff. Spooks. It's just common sense. God. Beats, do you believe in God? Is that a thing that you believe in? Beats, are you there? Hello? Well, fuck. Episode over.